So that's the type of shit that I don't like about Vlad. And I see what Tyrese is talking about. You got five million off of black culture. Culture vulture. You fuck with a real one this time, didn't you, bruh? He gonna talk about the man of uh, child support. What part of me going through a divorce is funny. What part of me going to court as a black man in the presence of a racist judge? What the fuck his child support got to do with anything? Talking about some, you know, this man, you know, is this, this, that, and other. And Tyree, man, I support you, man. Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E. He the reason you see me. You know, when I called him, you know, to tell him, man, let's do another interview. He didn't answer my phone call. So, you know, at the time I was young, I told you about that. So I like, you know, like, nigga, what's up? You know, man, what the fuck is up? You know what I'm saying, nigga? You know what I mean? I don't, I don't, I don't know how to be diplomatic at this time. I didn't have problems. You was young, man. You, you know was younger. So I yeah, think yeah. that's what offended, but black, but that's what uh, kind of, you know, uh, uh, you know, whatever caused a wedge. And I said, but you know, hey, man, I, man, fuck that shit, man. I don't have to be on black. I don't have to be on that shit, man. You know what I'm saying? And then a lot of my people is mad at Vlad because they call him a culture vulture. That's what you know I'm saying. saying. They saying that he's still in our culture, that he's not keeping it real, not keeping 100. And then he get asked to do. See, what's so crazy. I'm glad that that we, we brought this back up because the, the time that he asked Boosie about was, the pimp, about did, the he, did, 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 did he know me and was the tape real? Boosie was already scheduled to go on Drink Champs the week next the next week and go sure on did. to go on a, a eighty five song with you and, no way. and on Beehive. So how you gonna ask a man that's signed to my literary agency? Do he know me? And I'm study saying it in all the interviews like I'm some kind of sucker. You know what I mean? Like I'm lying about this man. And then when the man get on Drink Champs and say, yeah, Ken and Steve-O gave me the book deal, they put me on they put me on a game. I know he had to feel like an asshole, but see mm -hmm. that's. What Vlad do? Vlad, he starts some shit. You know what I'm saying? He'll say some shit. So, you know, <laughs> he'll say some shit so they can say, yeah, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Fuck him, man. Hey, man, fuck this nigga. Fuck that nigga. And then he it gets the views happen. and he make money. You know what I'm saying? And that's where a lot of black people don't like about Vlad TV. It's like he's an instigator. He's instigating our people to try to pit our people against each other. Now, if I if Boosie would have said something negative towards me, that would have created a wrench between me and him. Or if Boosie would have said something. You see what happened with him and T.I.? Well, he asked Tyrese yeah. about, he asked, he asked Boosie about Tyrese after he offered Tyrese $10,000, according mm -hmm. to, to uh, allegedly, according to uh, Tyrese, that if he would come on the show. Rapper and you singers and you actors decide to look the other way for somebody who continues to disrespect us going on the show. Tyrese turned the 10,000 down and going to get your money. He offered me 10,000. And then he asked Boosie, have you heard about this with Tyrese? And, but, but, but and, and at, Boosie didn't even speak on it. Look at the T.I. situation. Boosie and T.I. had a record mm -hmm. coming together. Him and T.I. had a relationship that kids and friends. And you know what I'm saying? Me, you know, he know that Boosie, you know what I'm saying, me, gonna speak his mind, you know what I'm saying, he gonna, he gonna, try, he gonna, he gonna try to inoculate that in the conversation to, cre to create this problem. And that's the problem I have with you, Vlad. You got to quit trying to cause confusion in our community. Period. And, and all my brothers and sisters, you know, if you want my opinion, until you get it right, I, 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 I urge y'all to boycott Vlad TV. Boycott Wait a minute, so Vlad you want TV. To, you want to boycott? Them, I want them to stop watching that shit. The man, hey, don't hey, watch. hey, what, hey, I got, I got, the, and I got the, uh, the, uh, what they call that, uh, DM to prove his, his team. Yeah, you see yeah, that yeah, to me. Yeah, his team. You seen it? You yeah. got, it. I, you got his team hit me up, asked me, do I want to come on the, the thing? I, I thought, you know, the man was trying to, you know, straight some bush. I said, yeah. So he didn't let me on there. So the other dude that worked with him, we did an interview, and that shit went viral. So the dude yeah. was like, man, Vlad don't want the interview. I'll take the interview. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, that's, to me, that's some weak ass shit. You know, why would you be mad, you know, about some shit that happened 12 years ago? And then why would you not have me on your show, but the only time you talk about me is when you uh, asking another person about, you know, do, is I'm telling the truth. Like Boosie the, knew, knew what was going on. Boosie went there with me and Pimpsey no. was there. So why would you ask Boosie, is that true? That ain't nothing that he should be asking Boosie, do he know me and, and, and do, uh, 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 is it true that Pimpsey King got seen a sex tape? How would he know that? Mm. That's circumstantial. How would he know that? You know what I'm saying? So that's the type of shit that I don't like about Vlad. And I see what Tyrese is talking about. You got five million off of black culture. Culture vulture. You fuck with a real one this time, didn't you, bruh? He gonna talk about the man of uh, child support. 
part of me going through a divorce is funny. What part of me going to court as a black man in the presence of a racist judge? What the fuck his child support got to do with anything? Talking about some, you know, this man, you know, is this, this, that, another. And Tyree, man, I support you, man. You know what I'm saying? Me and, 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 hey, hey, I'm team motherfucking uh, Tyree. Man, I like you ever, ever since baby boy. <laughs> <laughs> Look, and I was at Tyree's house. We did the campaign. Uh, we did the campaign with um, your guy who was just ran for mayor. Oh my gosh, on the tip of my tongue. Oh man, but we did all his whole, his whole campaign, and we did a launch party at Tyrese's house. Oh so yeah, uh, I that's me. Kasim Reed. Kasim Reed, please yeah. forgive me. Kasim Reed, we did his whole campaign when he ran for mayor, and Tyrese was one of the people who supported Kasim Reed all the way through. So wow, he always man, you with know, I, like I said, um, Vlad has. And I, and I I got to be the you know how you 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 go on to this other side. He's been in the music industry. DJ mm -hmm. Vlad is is what they call him, and and I think that's the thing that ties him to the fact that he feels he can you know talk. And then you got Charlemagne the God. You got uh, different people who rock out with him. You know uh, different people who support that. You know like like I've seen him rock with him. But at the end of the day, I don't know how deep they and I don't know how their relationship go. But I just know the people I see that rock with him you know well, you know we as but black. I got a question too because you said um you were invited on the show but it just he just it didn't fall through no they invite I send it to your husband right they, so they, but they, they invited they, me they so so you were gonna go on there right yeah I, I was gonna go on there and I was gonna you know speak my mind I was gonna check black you know? okay I was gonna check him and tell him like look you know you, anybody that know me know I'm real so I'm mm -hmm. not gonna be bullshit I mean I check gangsters you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying I check killers every day you know what I'm saying? So Vlad, you know, what is he to me? You know what I'm saying? I mean, you think I'm scared of Vlad? Mm -hmm. So you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I want to go on the show. I want to talk to him. And, I, and, you know, I mean, you okay, since you're a culture vulture, do you know about the hip-hop fraternity, Vlad? Do you know what's going on in the black community? Do you know all the great things that we're doing? Do you know about all the kids that we let perform for free? You know what I'm saying? But you want to talk about all this negativity? Of course I want to go in there. You know, and if they would have aired it, so be it. But he know me. I yeah. speak my mind. And, and I'm going to tell you something. that He... and. and and it's, it's been done by a few people, you know. I got friends that have been on there just for the smoke, you know. I okay. I got people who go to Vlad. Uh, you know, a lot of times he don't do it. it you, you be in a room somewhere, not even at his place. He won't even get in the room. Man, that you. dude don't. I was there when he did it, Grady. You know, Grady and Steve was my business partner. Yeah. So we brought Grady on to Vlad. Steve brought Grady on to Vlad. I was there with him. We was in the room, and Vlad was behind a, a camera. I looked at him on the camera. What's up, Vlad? Seemed like he's seen a ghost. And then his, his, his uh, assistant at the time, this before I made the comments, his assistant at the time said, say, man, Vlad Ken want to call you. So I talked to him. I said, so what's up, man? You know, what's up with the interview? You know what I'm saying? I mean, woo, 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 woo. Hey, man, you know, I'm busy. That's what he said. I'm busy. How are you not going to interview Ken Ivey when I got, you know, millions of, uh, of views on TV? I mean, I, in, the, in, the the last, in the last, what, say, uh, maybe three, four, five months. I probably did about fifteen no, to working. twenty yeah. interview, twenty view, twenty million views on YouTube's or better. So you know what I'm saying? That's that's content for your for your platform. But like I said, you know, he he probably still traumatized from when I checked him. I know Rick Ross had to go upside his head a couple of times, you know. And I know if I would have, you know, been younger, if I would have called him, I probably went upside his head too. You know what I mean? I'm just, <laughs> I'm just being honest. When I was 31, I would have peeled Vlad's head when I was 31. But, you know, I'm much older now, so, you know, I would never, wiser. you know, I would never do that, you know, at this point in time. But, you know, you know, at that time, when I was a kid, when I was on, when, when, when Vlad, you know, didn't answer my phone call, I feel like he would treat me like a bitch ass nigga, like he was being disrespectful. And I went in on him, you know what I'm saying? And he know what happened, I know what happened, but like I said, you know, I'm a lot older now, and I was trying to, you know, ameliorate that shit, but you know, I mean, the dude just a coward, man, you know what I'm saying? He's scared to talk to me. Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E-He, the reason you see me.